Welcome to the Teacher Lumaban YouTube channel, your gateway in mastering the marketing mix a comprehensive guide. Our mission is to provide you with a dynamic and immersive learning experience, catering to both structured and self-directed learners. Here, you'll have the flexibility to dive into educational content at your own pace, actively engaging and interacting with the material. Get ready to embark on an exciting educational journey with us right here on the Teacher Lumaban YouTube channel. Commit your way to the Lord, trust also in Him, and He shall bring it to pass. Psalm 37 verse 5 Ever wondered how successful companies seem to have their products or services just right for their target market? That's the magic of the marketing mix. The marketing mix, also known as the four P's, product, price, place, and promotion, is a fundamental concept in marketing. It's a tool that businesses use to determine a product or brand's offering and is pivotal to a company's marketing strategy. The mix is about putting the right product in the right place at the right time and at the right price. When done correctly, it results in satisfied customers, more sales, and a thriving business. It's a delicate balance of elements that, when mixed together, create a recipe for success. So it's no wonder that mastering the marketing mix can give companies a significant competitive edge. So, are you ready to delve into the world of marketing mix? Let's get started. The marketing mix is commonly known as the 4 PS. Product, Price, Place, and Promotion. Sounds simple, right? But each P is a world in itself. Let's dive in. First up is product. This P is all about what you're selling whether it's a physical item, a service or even an experience. It's important to understand the needs and wants of your customers and develop a product that not only satisfies them but also stands out in the market. What are its features? How does it benefit the customer? Remember, a well-defined product can be the cornerstone of a successful marketing strategy. Next, we have price. Here, we're talking about how much your customer is willing to pay for your product. It's all about finding the sweet spot where the price reflects the perceived value of the product. Price it too high and you might lose potential customers, price it too low and you could undervalue your product. So, it's crucial to get this right. Then comes place. This refers to where and how your product is sold. It could be a physical store, an online platform, or even both. The goal is to ensure your product is easily accessible to your target customers. It's also about understanding where your customers prefer to shop and making your product available there. Last but not least, we have promotion. This is all about how you communicate with your customers. It's not just about advertising but also public relations, social media, sales promotions and more. The aim is to create awareness, generate interest, and ultimately drive sales. It's essential to choose the right promotional mix that communicates effectively with your target market. So there you have it. The four P's of the marketing mix product, price, place, and promotion. Each P plays a critical role in a successful marketing strategy. While they may appear simple on the surface, they require a deep understanding and strategic thinking to master. Now that we have a basic understanding of the four P's, let's take a closer look at each one. The first P is product. This is what you're selling, but it's so much more than that. At its core, a product is a solution, a way to resolve a consumer's problem or fulfill their desire. It's not just about the physical item or the service you're offering, but the features and benefits that it carries. Understanding your product is crucial. Every detail, every feature, every benefit matters. Each aspect of your product should be designed to meet the needs and wants of your consumers. You must know how your product stands out, how it's unique, and how it adds value to the consumer's life. The success of your product isn't just about what it does, but how it does it differently and better than its competitors. It's about how it makes a consumer's life easier, more enjoyable, more exciting. Remember, a successful product is one that fulfills a need in a way that no other product can. Next up is price. It's not just about what consumers pay, it's about the value they get. Price isn't just a tag on a product. It's a delicate balance, a dance between the cost of production and the perceived value in the eyes of the consumer. When we talk about pricing strategies, we're really talking about understanding the consumer perception and demand. Imagine a luxury handbag. The materials and labor might cost a fraction of the final price, but consumers are willing to pay a premium for the brand, for the status it confers, for the craftsmanship. That's perceived value. 
On the other hand, a budget-friendly product might appeal to consumers looking for practicality over prestige. Pricing is a powerful tool in the marketing mix. It informs the consumer about the product. It tells them whether it's a luxury item or a budget-friendly one. It's an integral part of the overall value proposition. Price is more than a number. It's a tool to communicate the value of your product. The third P is place. You have a great product at the right price, but where can your customers find it? It's all about accessibility. The distribution strategy you choose can make or break your product's success. Think of it this way. Your product is a star, and the place is the stage. Without the right stage, even the brightest star can fail to shine. You must ensure your product is available where your customers are likely to look for it. This might be a brick-and-mortar store, an online marketplace, or a combination of both. Now consider the journey your product has to take from the production line to the customer's hands. It's a path filled with decisions about transportation, warehousing, and inventory management. Each decision impacts your product's accessibility and ultimately, your customer's satisfaction. So, think carefully about your place strategy. It's not just about location, it's about making your product reachable and desirable. Remember the place isn't just a physical location, it's wherever your customer decides to buy. Last but not least, we have promotion. How will your customers know about your product? Let's delve into the world of promotional strategies, shall we? It's the missing piece that ties everything together in our marketing mix. Promotion is more than just advertising. It's a multifaceted approach to getting your product noticed. It's about raising awareness, generating interest, and ultimately, driving sales. Think of it as the megaphone that amplifies your product's message to the world. So how does one go about promoting a product? There are several strategies at your disposal. Traditional methods like television and radio advertisements, billboards, and print media can still be effective. But in the digital age, it's crucial to leverage online platforms. Social media campaigns, email marketing, search engine optimization, and content marketing are just a few of the tools in a modern marketer's toolbox. Promotion isn't a one-size-fits-all solution. What works for one product may not work for another. It's about understanding your target market, their preferences, and where they spend their time. A well-crafted promotion strategy should consider these factors and tailor the message accordingly. Remember, promotional strategies are not just about getting the word out, they are also about building a connection with your audience. It's about storytelling. Every product has a story and promotion is about sharing that story in a way that resonates with your audience. Effective promotion creates a narrative around your product. It answers why your product exists, what problem it solves, and why it's better than the alternatives. This narrative makes your product more than just an item on a shelf. It makes it a solution, an experience, a part of your customer's life. Promotion is an ongoing process. It's not about making a single big splash, but about maintaining a consistent presence. It's about engaging with your audience, listening to their feedback, and adapting your strategies. In a nutshell, promotion is a critical part of the marketing mix. It's how you get your product noticed, how you generate interest, and how you drive sales. Without it, even the best product can go unnoticed. Promotion is all about communication. It's how you tell your product's story to the world. We've taken a journey through the four PS of the marketing mix, each one crucial in its own way. Let's take a moment to recap and remember why each ingredient in this mix is so vital. We started with product, the heart of the marketing mix. This is what you're offering to your customers, and it's essential to understand that it isn't just about physical goods. It can be a service, an idea, or even a personality. The key is to ensure that your product meets the needs of your target customer and stands out in the bustling marketplace. Next, we tackled price, the value proposition. It's not just about slapping a sticker on your product, it's about setting a price that reflects the perceived value of your product, while also considering factors like the cost of production, market conditions, and competitor pricing. Striking the right balance is crucial to ensuring profitability and customer satisfaction. We then moved on to place, which is all about making your product accessible. This doesn't just mean having it in stores, it's about understanding where your target customers are and ensuring that your product is available there. This might be online, in a brick and mortar store or even at a pop-up event. The key is to make it easy for your customers to find and purchase your product. Finally, we explored promotion spreading the word about your product. This can take many forms from traditional advertising to social media campaigns to public relations efforts. 
The goal is to communicate the benefits of your product to your target audience and convince them to buy. The power of the marketing mix lies in the interconnection of these four elements. They don't exist in isolation. They're like the ingredients in a recipe. You need the right balance to create a successful dish. And just like a recipe, the marketing mix needs to be adjusted for each unique situation and target audience. Remember the marketing mix is not a static concept, it's a dynamic tool that should evolve with your target market and business goals. Now go out there and mix it up.